which was a record sum for golf, $7,000. The fight between Tommy McGovern and Billy Thompson for the British Lightweight Championship was over almost before it had begun. Weakened by reducing, was KO'd in 45 seconds, including the count. Even McGovern can't have expected such a sudden triumph, but he definitely knew what he wanted next, a crack at European honours. Well, I'm very pleased that I've won the title, and I hope to do bigger things yet. Thank you. Big boxing news, of course, naturally centres around the Turpin-Robinson fight. And here's Sugar Ray getting into his stride at Pumpton Lakes. The ex-title holder is determined to find his real form and obviously be a tough opponent for our only world champion. Anyway, here's Sugar Ray's own view of the matter. I know you'll be hearing from Randy Turpin through British Movie Tone News, so here in Pompton Lakes I'd like to add a little. I hope to be successful and I know Randolph has the same idea. Down at Grossinger Lakes... Randy's success hasn't gone to his head, but he certainly displayed a healthy confidence when he was interviewed. Well, I'd like to say hello to all my friends at home through the British Movie Town News here in America. When the fight comes up on the 12th, I should be under percent as I was in England, and I'm sure that I should be bringing the title back to England with me. Not quite in the same class, perhaps, but well on the way are these Australian youngsters. Dwarfed by the referee, two stone seven fights two stone 11, and what a fight. Ref has a terrifying decision to make, who hit who, but he takes the easy way out and makes it a draw. 